Good to see your face again. Yours too. Lalea is the daughter of Kifisos, god of this spring. It's said that she lives in these pools. Thea, right? Beric Dioni told me you've been acting as general. Though, from what I saw earlier, you and your sister don't see eye to eye. Perry would die folded in prayer before she asked for my advice. Her distraction has allowed the sons of Xerxes to advance. And now we are on the knife's edge waiting for the slaughter and we have done nothing. I must prepare myself to fight and hopefully the others too. Can you teach me? Your sister says you act like a general. Let's see if you fight like one. I'm ready. What the? I told you not to go easy on me. You hit hard. Was humbling. The sons of Xerxes won't be as kind. No. It's a good wake-up call. One I wish Perry could have. But Big Sister always knows best. Sounds like she's always giving you a hard time. <laughs> you could say that. Acting like the hero while I do the dirty work. Now you have the Eagle Bearer on your side. Then you'll be the Perseus to my Andromeda. I seem to recall the legend saying that Andromeda was nude and tied to a rock. Was she? I'll have to remember that the next time I'm reenacting the myth. Lalea has a rich heritage for theater, though not so much for fighting. I've seen kings and commanders. You share their temperament. Perry married the governor. I am unwed. Spinsters do not become leaders. We exist on the fringes. Spartan women are taught to keep up with Spartan men. Lalea seems different. It is an oversight that I've been pushing to correct. When the men leave for war, our defenses are limited to a few hunters too valuable to leave. Or young men who can barely hold a spear. And now that the hunters are dead... We're more exposed to attacks from the sons of Xerxes than ever. We should get back to the task at hand. There's still a lot to do. You're right. But it's hard to know where to start. I need to train the others for war, but we are without weapons and armor. No blacksmith. But his daughter is still here. And what about the hunters you lost? We need to train replacements. There's also a camp close by. Likely the daughters of Artemis. They are not a friendly bunch, so we've been doing our best to avoid them. Not sure how useful I'll be to the blacksmith's daughter. Metheodosa mentioned needing some materials before she can get started. And between you and me, she needs a little push. She's been helping her father at the forge since she could walk, but she still doubts her own abilities. Who should I train to hunt? I've met with some volunteers from the village. They've got a little experience, but need to have their bow arms straightened. You can find them on the edge of La Lea. I'll get to it.
tell me to make the weapons, but do any of them ask if I know how? Oh, who are you? A mercenary hired by the village magistrate. Oh, that explains why I don't know you. I'm Ethiadusa. Please don't tell me you need new weapons or armor. I don't, but the rest of the village does. Oh, that's worse. I thought you were the village blacksmith. Why are you so reluctant? I'm not the village blacksmith. My father is, and my brother is his apprentice. I just fetch wood when they need it. <sighs> now they all expect me to arm the village. Are you the only member of your family left? I'll know when the men return from war. Matter left with the ferryman last year. Is there any way I can help? <sighs> I think Pater left the molds and tools nearby, but I need ore, and even then I might make something utterly useless. You look capable enough to me. There's a difference between knowing how to do something with your mind and knowing how to do it with your hands. Fair enough. What kind of ore do you need? Any kind of ore will technically do, but... But... My pater used the legendary ore when making a dagger for my mother. It is called Aphrodite's ore. Sounds strange, but it's true. Where can I find the ore? It's hard to reach. It's down the cliffs at the Persian remnants in a secret cave just above the water. Sounds like you've been there before. I told you, I wasn't a smith. I was there to fetch what pater needed. I'd go myself, but I need to hit up the kiln. How did the ore get its name? The legend says Ephestos, god of the forge, found this ore and used it to make a helmet for his wife, Aphrodite. She loved it for its color. Because of that, the ore works in the hands of any smith. I'll bring back Aphrodite's ore. <laughs> That must be the cave. I can see why this ore is named for Aphrodite.
That should be enough ore from Metiadusa. Time to head back. I found the ore. Amazing. Already the molds. Will that be enough for the village? It should be a good start. Oh, that reminds me. I have a problem. You and the rest of Lalea. I'm just one smith, and I can divide my time between making weapons and armor. But it will slow down the process. It would be faster if I just worked on one. Which should I focus on? Weapons or armor? We can't kill bandits without weapons. We'll just have to hope their archers have poor aim. Yes, you're right. Your confidence gives me hope. Thank you for your help. <gasps> Ενώ